Rise up, rise up, time to rise up. How to raise your energy and vibration is something that's been talked a lot about. Easy to say, easy to do. Let's dive in deep and figure out what that looks like in real life. Why do you want to raise your vibration? Why? What does that even mean, raise your vibration? I mean like vibration, again, vibration is the word very similar to energy. When we hear the word vibration, let's take the new ageness, even though I like the word, I used it, is let's look at what does that mean. Vibration has to do with, if you want to look at the science of it, it's, you can look deeper into yourself, but it's kind of like the frequency, your energy, it going up and down. There's different levels. Look it up. But it's similar to energy, frequency, resonance, similar language, whatever word you want to use. I don't care. What I do care about is showing you ways to do it. There are simple ways and you can do it regularly. First one, easy tip, get into nature. Get into nature. That's it. It doesn't have to be a park. It could be one tree. Just go out and be around things that are alive. Alive. It could be the water, the trees, the mountains. Looking at the stars. See your star? Which gets me to my next one. One sec. What do you surround yourself with to raise your vibration? Do you have things in your room that make you feel okay or make you feel fantastic? I've shared this in one of my videos before. This is my friend. Got it for me for... Christmas last year? Yeah. For Christmas, I wanted something like light blue and she got this for me. I never asked for this and I'm like, oh my god, it's so perfect. It's something that's like fun and childlike and silly. I don't have anything like this. And make it easy. Easy to feel good. So whenever I look at it, I'm like, ah, oh, ring my vibration. Feel good. Feel good. You know, you don't have to be grown up and when you're a grown up, you have to act this way. Not me. It's Finding ways that feel good, easy. Don't make raising your vibration just one thing. There's music, talk to a friend. Raising our vibration though is not just an emotional thing. When you're feeling overwhelmed, you're not sure, go outside. Said it before nature, go outside. It's because you get to be out and feel the air and things moving. A long time ago, we weren't, I'm not saying we should go back to the dark ages, but we weren't living in these houses and flats and buildings and all these things. We had to go out and find our food and we were meant to move. We were meant to go around. Well, meant is what we decided to be. Our reality changes. The point is you Get to have fun deciding and being the architect of your vibration in life. Simple. So how does that work for your vibration? You raise it and you can use crystals. You use this as an example. I mean, it can be something simple. You could even choose a pencil to raise your vibration, an object. If you want to talk about physically. Like, look at this. It's like an emerald on it and I love it. It's just a pencil. That's all it is. It's not a real emerald, of course. And yeah, it's fun. And to me, uh, emeralds, I think of like multi-dimensionality, if you think kind of the movie Return to Oz, not Wizard of Oz, Return to Oz, different book. And it's having fun with it, emotionally. So that's physically. There's physically you can find things to do. Now emotionally, if you want to continue on that realm. Mentally, you can speak to a friend, you can talk to them on the phone, you can talk to yourself if you need to. Speak out loud, have fun with your voice, try different voices. Hello, 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 hello. We ha start laughing. There's laughter therapy. Like, <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. laugh, laugh, laugh some more. Laugh, laugh. Here we go. I heard a saying once that said, "A good time to laugh is any time that you can, not necessarily at the expense of others. Be nice, but just laugh. Laugh at yourself. Laugh at anything. Somebody's like, hello. You can even laugh at that if you want. Although, laugh at them. They're like, that's not funny. I'm like, why not? What makes something funny or not funny? The meaning we attach to it. So break it up. That's raising our vibration right now. Laugh. Laugh. Just find a way. Just tell yourself laugh. Smile. 
Smile. Do the power poses. I've done this, talked about this before. Power poses like this. Do, 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 do. Superhero. That's right. Yep. Physically with your body. Emotionally. You will start to feel different. Biggest, biggest, biggest tip I have, actually, is light. Light. Light helps to raise your vibration. Why does it work? I don't fully know. That's a real answer. I don't know. But seeing the sunlight, huge, huge. There's, I guess, the vitamin D coming in. There's that part of it. There's something powerful about light. And light doesn't have to just be white. For example, did you know that a red light can actually help you to sleep better? Absolutely, because those computers and TV monitors and cell phones, mobiles, all these things emit, you don't see it, but it's called blue light and it affects your sleep and it makes you stay up. Same in LED lights, by the way. I recommend using the regular incandescent light bulb, but you'll feel free to use LED if that's what works for you. An upcoming video on EMF, electromagnetic frequency, is coming. So stay tuned for that. And I'll explain more why and how it affects us. But going forward, that's something you can do is use a red light bulb. Something like that is fun. Don't have to use it all the time. But light. Get yourself in the light. Feel the light. Notice light. It's your alarm bell. That light. How am I affecting the light? If that's what we are, we are light beings. We are light. Then be that light. Look at that light. What does that light look like? Our emotions. Does that look like the motions that we move? Then think about the light. Focus on the light. See the light. I see the light. Then the way to raise your vibration is to write it out. Express it. Find a way to express. And express what you want to feel. I want to feel this. I want to feel happy. I want to feel sad. I want this, this, this. And what if I was feeling that? What would that look like? Now don't expect to jump from down here up to here. Take little, little steps and notice little increments of when you're starting to feel better. Huge impacts. Huge. Meditation. I mean, that's kind of self-explanatory. Raises your vibration because you get clear. I talk about this in my book. Another big tip that I have. I may have mentioned it before, but I'm going to say it again. Here's a freebie for you from my book, Easy Enlightenment Transform Your Days. It's like a dollar right now, limited time on Amazon as I get this book out there even more. It is reaching people, which is fantastic. And the way is to look at your thoughts and just go clear, 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 clear. Just like that. You are clearing your thoughts. Just say, keep saying clear. And if you're not alone, you can say it inside. You're raising your vibration. Vibration, high vibe isn't just party time. It also can be quiet, solid, resonance of an essence. Might want to think, what the hell does that mean? Resonance of an essence. What does that mean? Is sensing. Sensing in your, what are you, what do you sense? What is your extrasensory coming into that place? You're on the fifth sense, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. There's so much more to us. That's how we raise our vibration, is we get in tune with the message I have really big today. If I have one takeaway message is, ask yourself this really powerful question, and I do this myself sometimes. I actually woke up with this message to give today, and here it is. Who am I connecting to? What am I connecting to? Say that again. Who or what am I connecting to? When you do that, you start to go, am I connecting with emotion? Am I connecting with this? Who am I connecting? What am I connecting to? And then you start thinking, how, what kind of connection do I want? Do I want an, my internet connection? Is it strong? Is it, is the signal dropping? Is it slow? What would a higher plane look like? Start to imagine what that would be like. What would that be like for you? Imagination is a beautiful thing. So I think I've given you many ways to start raising your vibration in ways that really work. And make, try them out, not just at home. I challenge you to do it anywhere. On your walking, on your way to work, at work, in the bathroom. Well, I mean, do your business. But 
do it in places that you wouldn't naturally expect to do it because then you become it as a natural habit. That is the goal here is to have the high vibration more and more and more often. I want you to have fun raising your vibration and look at it in ways that are simple. It isn't just feeling good, but that's a great start. It's in a place of clear clarity, deciding the quality of who and what our lives are.